Isn't this just a convenient sign? I'm pretty sure it's like 5 a.m. right now. I just finished editing a video for Giancarlo. Here it is. Go check that out. It'll be out by the time this video is out. And if you missed my last video, go check it out. There'll be a card on the screen, but you can also just check it out in the description or whenever, whenever you want. want. I'm kind of fucking with the whole GoPro vibe. I know a lot of people don't fuck with the GoPro vibe, but um, I do, so. Before I go to sleep, I want to show you something. Having information won't hurt, but lacking information will. So that's why I have this thing. This is my projection for when I want to hit 15K. I really, really want to hit it by this date. Go follow my Instagram if you haven't already, because this video will be out before the 15th of... June. I don't know why I didn't record this, probably mainly because I'm fucking stupid, but I literally just got the word all on my second try. And I don't even know why I picked depth out of this all the second words in the world. But yeah, now I'm going to sleep. It's 5.40 a.m. The next day. So I kind of accidentally recorded this as a time lapse, but I'm basically just explaining how I'm getting ready to go to the city because I have a job interview. It's like 12 p.m. Woke up late. Mmm, some pasta, a cock, and some wadi. Look at this. Ah! Ah! What? What? Oh what? Cards for LGBT, $35. Cards for straight people, $45. That is the best deal I've seen in a while. Yeah. So basically, I'm heading to the city today. I have this little job ting at this little place called Battery Showroom. Oh my god. She went to our high school. The train. Is it here? It's coming. Sorry, should I like try to hold it? No. Yeah, I'll no, go hold it. I'm no, not gonna just leave. What? No, we should just. No, leave. no, no. I'll just go. Hold I'll literally go. Yes. I would like to see you try. We should just go. But the train is like We're here. We're not even gonna make it because we have to cross. See her with the. Th she couldn't carry three fucking drinks. You didn't even had a bag for three drinks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm imitating. Go, go. Over here. Look at this guy. Over here. You have everything. You ordered in the middle and you ordered the most. You want some? <laughs> And the other bitch was just standing there too. She <laughs> Can you tie my shoe while I drink that? Hey, hey, too tight. You know what's too tight? Can you stop tightening? Choo choo, do you like it loosey goosey? Yes, okay. That explains Don't a lot. Did you grab the entourage? Yes. <laughs> it could just be packed so tight that it. Julie, can I get your No. I'll tie your shoe. I already tied it. Yeah, you did. Oh. <laughs> We're off the train. We're in and We're going to the subway. Excuse me, sir. Did you just pay your fare? Hey, get out my face, bro. So I just finished this job interview at Bowery, and it's secure. You already know. I'm so excited, actually. And here they are. What would hurt more, getting hit by a bike or getting hit by a car? What? I vote bike. Bike? Well, yeah. we're talking like a non-lethal situation. And like a normal bike. like 10 to 15 miles per hour. Like if you were walking in a suburban neighborhood, crossing the street, and someone blew a stop sign, would you rather get hit by a bike or a car? I'd rather get, get by, by the a car. car. Because, boom, <laughs> hey, like you'd be like, oh, you know, maybe even like hop on top of yeah, it. Yeah, like roll but over. But the bike, no oh. matter what, oh skin's God, breaking. So You're bad. getting scraped. For me, thank you. We took a stop at District 1, yeah, and now so we're much. at a deli. Thank you. Have a good night. A little bike action. I haven't ridden a bike in years, honestly. All right, so we're on a city bike right now. Um, Mikey's up there, Anthony's behind me. Yeah. All right, you're on your own. We gotta catch our hikey. I don't understand how this bike is working. It's so hard to pedal. Okay, so we just docked the city bikes and now we're walking back. Take a subway back home. Oh my god, you guys are pathetic. I could have been whipping it in there. But <laughs> I swear to god, if anyone were to try to convince me that there's like a prettier city out there, 
they're lying to themselves. <laughs> I'm gonna put it in slow mo. Look, guys, look at all these cars. Oh my fucking god, they're literally coming to kill me. I was gonna say, that used to be me. I used to drive into the city all the time, but now I don't wanna fucking do that ever. 90% of the time that I come into the city, I don't wanna drive because finding parking is ass and I'm not trying to go through that. I don't love walking. And even the city bike, I literally caught a cramp today. But I will tell you this much, I don't really love driving in the city. Don't get me wrong, sometimes it's cool when it's like late at night. Just every day driving in the city, I would literally rather do anything else. Okay. But yeah, now we're just walking to the subway because we gotta take the subway to get to the Allies of LR. Dead back to Long Island to get back home and pretty much just end the night. In the comments below, would you live in New York City? And if you would or wouldn't, why? Me personally, I would live in the city, but I don't know if I would want to like raise a family here. It's not the vibe. What about you, Mikey? Would you live in the city? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This would be my neighborhood real quick. What about you, Anthony? Would you live in the city? I do live here <laughs> part-time. Yeah, you do. So the answer is yeah. I'm actually waiting to move back. Yeah, and what's your favorite part? Um, Probably just like the energy and the people that live here. The people that want to live in New York City or the type of people I want to be around. Mm, good answers from all of us. Do you want to have a dance off? <laughs> Alright, so we just got on the train and I'm gonna take a peek sees at these shoes. I didn't try them on at District 1 and I do own two pairs of fours but both of them don't fit. They're actually the wrong size. I just took a wild guess and was like, well, if the ones that I bought are too big, let's hope I'm a size 5. Oh yeah, baby. Perfect size. I need to like loosen the laces and stuff like that. Yeah, just a quick recap on the day. I feel like I keep forgetting the fact that like I currently have a new job. And I'll definitely get to talking about that more in like a separate video and as things start to unfold. But for the most part, today was pretty chill. We had a fun day. We like rode the city bikes and stuff like that, which was fun. So I'm gonna end the video here, guys. Uh, if you guys wanna see more content from me, you guys can peep my Instagram, my TikTok, my Snapchat, all my other social medias at Fubi slash Juju Famigia. Check it out. Yeah, guys. Gonna end the vlog off here. Had a great day with some with some dudes. Anyways, yeah, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch my content. It literally means the world to me. And with that being said, let's see you guys in my next one. Adios, muchachos. Stab me the fuck.